Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we'll talk about the Savannah Pension Scheme. So, the Savannah Pension Scheme is a scheme that's developed by India for uh, providing the financial support to the elderly. So, this is for uh, especially for women and it's got a place in your National uh, Social Assistance Program as well, the NSAP and in uh, liaison with your uh, Ministry of Rural Development. So this provides pension to senior citizens who are above a specific age group. So the uh, salient feature of this Savannah Pension Scheme is it provides a monthly pension to all the deserving uh, low income uh, women and it's also launched as an initiative by the NSAP and it's got become an uh, increasing financial stability to the elderly and uh, it also gives the, uh, improves the quality of life for the olden people as well. So the benefits of the uh, Savannah Pension the first one is going to be your Indira Gandhi National Old Age Pension Scheme. So this pension scheme ta targets all the elder elderly individuals who are above 60 years of age. So they get a pension of about 200 rupees every month. And if you are crossing the age of 79, you get a pension of about 500 as well. And uh, this is uh, taken care by the government of revenue. And these days the government of Kerala has taken the initiative and the implementation of it. And they are taking control of this uh, completely. The second system or the second uh, pension scheme which is provided by NSAP is your uh, Indira Gandhi National Widow Pension Scheme. So this pension scheme gives uh, a widow lady a uh, pension of 200 monthly and the state government also pays her 400. So since uh, March 2019 the recipient of this uh, um, the uh, widow's scheme will get 600 rupees uh, added up to their pension every month. The third pension scheme which is provided is your pension scheme for your unmarried women. So this is especially for women who are divorced or who are a widow and who have crossed an age of 50. So the government gives a monthly pension of 1500 rupees every month to them. So this automatically adds up to a boost to their financial health. Then the fourth pension scheme that's been provided is your Indira Gandhi National Disability Pension Scheme. This gives you a a lending support is also given on this. There's a 40% lending support given and this has to be like approved by a medical officer. So a medical officer has to like ascertain that and who has to like certify that you are disabled. Then the government lends you up to like 40% of your requirement. And then also this pensioners, they also get about 300 rupees per month on this uh, pension scheme. The last pension scheme which is there is your agricultural labor pension scheme. So this provides a, a pension scheme of about 1500 rupees for low income levels or also for agricultural laborers. So they'll be able to get like 1500 rupees every month to meet out their financial stability. So these are all going to be a different types of uh, um, pension schemes which are provided by your uh, Savannah uh, initiative or the Savannah pension which is initiated by the government. The next question comes to our mind is like how do I apply for such a scheme or where do I avail these services from? So there are a list of documents which the government requires from you. The first document would be a copy of your Aadhaar card, then your ration card, your proof of residence. Then if at all you're going to apply for your disability pension, then you need to have a medical certificate as well, followed by your bank account information along with your phone numbers and all the other applicable things. So once you apply for this and you can go to your nearest branch and on apply for this or you can apply through online as well using the online application form. And after you apply that, the pension would automatically get added up into your account month on month thereafter. So this becomes an easier way for women of this nation to get financially boosted up and they get morally supported as well. And if you like this video, don't forget to share it with your friends and do like this video as well and subscribe to this channel as well. And for more such insightful content, follow this channel and I'll catch you up in the next one. Thank you for watching.